A Quest for Heroes RPG is an adventure RPG game made by the aspiring indie developer Simon Daniel Larson. Daniel is previously known for his efforts in the musical act Thunderstrike, as well as his solo music career. A Quest for Heroes starts the protagonist called You. You, the player, and you, the hero, start off unknowing of what is going on, effectively creating a sense of connection to the character you are playing. You awaken to find your dead friend's mutilated remains lying beside your body as a wise man speaks to you and tells you what to do. The game very quickly eases you into the simple but deep combat mechanics by having you battle this wise man, and then you're shortly thereafter given your first quest by the king. After completing your first quest, the game just doesn't give you any breaks. The story unfolds in such a natural fashion and it's just such a joy to play. It's especially great to see that the choices you make in the game actually matter and that there will be consequences to deal with. I found myself having to redo entire conversations because I picked the wrong dialogue option and this just gives so much depth to the game as a whole. The game lends itself many inspirations borrowing from such classics like Zelda and Final Fantasy, it manages to create a very fine blend of a sense of strategy, character building and adventure. Though I'd like to think that what this game mostly draws inspiration from is the cult classic Mythica, A Quest for Heroes. The title is clearly a tip of the hat to this uh, classic movie which really set the bar for all fantasy games and movies to proceed in. A Quest for Heroes has a very finely tuned class system which allows you to pick from four different classes which all define the way you play the game. Sadly, none of these classes allow you to wield guns, something which these days is an industry standard, seeing how Skyrim decided to include guns in its sequel, Fallout, it would only make sense for a quest for heroes to start thinking about including guns in newer updates. Characters in a quest for heroes are highly fleshed out and they feel so living and breathing, with voice acting so on point that it's hard to tell if the voice actor is actually acting, well, it's hard to not become invested in the characters' lives. Graphics are presented in a very stylish fashion and the world around you feels genuine. The bright colors lend themselves well to the more darker themes presented throughout the story. The story brings up many different themes such as alienation, gender equality, and other issues we face today as a society, and as such it's much deeper than your average run-of-the-mill RPG. To sum things up, A Quest for Heroes is a very well-composed game which really breathes new life into the adventure RPG genre. It pays respects where respect is due paid, and I'm looking at you, Mythica, and it brings a rich and mature storyline to boot. A Quest for Heroes is simply an amazing game with only one glaring flaw. There are no guns. So therefore, I'm giving A Quest for Heroes 4 out of 5 Churro Hot Dogs. Thank you for watching, and please like and subscribe for more great reviews and content. This has been Goidel Kim, signing out.